Our Father, in your divine wisdom, you brought forth this nation. A mixing pot of people. The common thread, which has not been race, but the common thread has been a yearning to be free. And a desire that all mankind be allowed to pursue you as he or she sees best. You've placed before us one of the most challenging times in modern history. We pray for your guidance. We pray your hand will be upon our president to give him wisdom, upon our leaders in Congress to help them to see beyond partisan politics and to rise as true statesmen for the good of our country and for the betterment of the world. We pray for our men and women in uniform that your hand of safety will be around them, that they will know that back home there are those that pray for them and support them we pray your blessings upon their families, the wives and the husbands, the children, the mothers and the fathers. Give them peace. And may we all yearn as much for the cup of your communion as we do for victory. You have seen fit to bless the world by blessing America. And our Father, we humbly ask that you would do it again. We humbly ask that we may rise above the politics of the moment and see the greater need. We humbly ask that leaders will step forward and that we will follow them prayerfully but with open minds, not blindly given our allegiance, we humbly ask that your church may continue to grow and prosper and that men and women will be called to faith in Christ Jesus. We humbly ask that you would bless America and through America bless the world. You've done it before, Father. We ask that you would do it yet again. In Jesus' name I pray.